always been something of the night about him. To receive the honor of knighthood, Sir Christopher Lee for services to drama and to charity. But when the blue-blooded Prince of Wales bestowed a knighthood on the Prince of Darkness, it only helped to seal Christopher Lee's status as a movie legend. Very happy for the sake of my family that they've given it to me. I don't know if any other actor of my age has received one. I'd be interested to check that out. Perhaps they thought it was best to give it to me before it was too late. He's most famous for his blood-curdling role as Dracula in the Hammer horror films. Ask him what he thinks of scary movies today and he'll still bite. It's what you don't see. And I won't go and see these films now. I, I don't particularly want to because everything is shown in gruesome and gory detail. And to me, that is not the way. He is the most prolific actor alive, with more than 250 screen credits to his name and a career that spans 60 years. If I'm a cult figure, it's because I survived. That's one thing. And I'm still working, and I've got seven films to come out. And I've been in a lot of films, some of which were comedies, some of which were scary movies, and they have become cult movies. But it's the Dracula role that will never die. How do you destroy a fiend who has so far proven himself indestructible? Christopher Lee becomes a knight of fright just before Halloween. Mysterious forces at work? Or are we all just suckers for vampires? Sarah Merchant, Sky News. Great fun. This is Sky News.